Welcome to Damascus Education Platform. Our lesson today about how people lived in the past. Here we have an ancient Rome. How people lived in ancient Rome? What uh, about their houses? What about their students? What did they study? And how people entertain themselves? Here we have Miracles and Antony. Miracles and Antony lived in Rome in 75 AD. Uh, what about their house and uh, what about their furniture? Let's see. They had a big house and servants. They didn't have much furniture. There weren't many chairs or tables. They sat on beds during the day and slept on them at night. So, uh, Miracles and Anthony lived in a big house, but they haven't much furniture. What about their study? What did they study in the past? Miracles was 14. He studied a lot of subjects like history, geography, astronomy, and philosophy. Antonia was 12. She studied reading, writing, mathematics, and how to look after a home. So, they were interested in astronomy. Astronomy means uh, the study of the stars and planets. And philosophy, philosophy, the study of ideas. Uh, and about girls, they uh, teach, taught them how to look after a home. What about their school and, uh, let's see, Miracles got up early. He drank some water, but he didn't have breakfast. He bought bread on the way to school. The streets were very busy. So, uh, uh, Miracles went to school and the streets in Rome were very busy. Now, how people in Rome entertain themselves, entertain or enjoy themselves? Let's see, the ancient Romans enjoyed many different kinds of entertainment. They often went to great festivals like shows in the, theat in the theaters, races and fights at the stadium where people fought wild animals. So uh, they entertained themselves by races, watching races and uh, watching shows in theaters. Now, what about uh, bathing and uh, food, or, or what they did eat? In the afternoon, Miracles went to baths with his father. There were very good baths in Rome. Antonia went to the women's baths with her mother. The family at dinner in the late afternoon, they had bread, vegetables, olives, grapes, and meats. So, uh, Antonia uh, go, uh, went to baths with her mother, uh, and Miracles went with his father, uh, and they had dinner at the afternoon. Uh, then, uh, here, we uh, talked about the ancient throne and what uh, did people do and how uh, they live it. Uh, here, yes, my dear students, we have a new vocabulary here and uh, their definition, definitions. Now, we uh, match the vocabulary with their definitions uh, here. Uh, I read the uh, vocabulary first. 
A. Astronomy, Philosophy, Entertainment, Stadium, Paths. Then uh, we match them with their definitions here. Yeah. The action of offering fun and enjoyment to people. What do you think? The action of offering fun and enjoying entertainment. Then we match A with C. Two, a large area for sports with seats around the people to watch. Then it is stadium. The study of stars and planets. The study of stars and planets. Yes, astronomy. A building where you can wash. A building where you can wash baths here. Yeah. The study of ideas. The study of ideas, it is philosophy. Then, uh, this is the new, uh, these are new words and their definitions. Yeah, here, uh, when we talked about ancient Rome, we use it symbol busts. We use it symbol busts to talk about actions that happened in the past. Uh, in fact, my dear students, we have two kinds of verbs. We have regular verbs and irregular verbs. We use subject with verbs plus ed with regular verbs to talk about yesterday last last with uh, time expression last last week last month last year and ago for example we visited my uncle yesterday we visited visit we add ed while regular verbs we use subject with verb to with irregular verbs the past form of the verb. Uh, for example, Hussam went to school yesterday. Go, we change it to the past form or verb to went. Hussam went to the school yesterday. Now we have the verbs are buy, do, read, go, win, have, meet, give. We use these verbs, uh, but we change it in verb to, to verb to, because we talk about yesterday. Look, yesterday. With yesterday, we change the verb uh, to uh, verb to. Ali and his family dinner at a restaurant. What did they do? They had dinner. Yes, we uh, choose have, but we change it to had with past form. Number two, had he some flowers to her aunt. What did she, she do? She gave the verb give, change it to gave because we uh, talk about yesterday. Three, we meet our friends. We meet, meet our friends. About yesterday, when we talk about yesterday, we meet our friends. Four, Salma to the market. Go. We change it to the past form, went. Went to the market. Sal Salma went to the market. Five, Yusuf 
do all his homework. We change do to did yesterday. Yusuf did all his homework yesterday. Samira uprise. Samira win uprise. We change win to won uprise with yesterday. I read a really good book. Read, we change it to read. We read a really, I read a really good book. Number eight, Mr. Hammer buy a new car. We change buy to boat a new car. So these are the past form for uh, the verb is verb to. Here, what about negative? Yes, how we can uh, make or change the uh, the past symbol to negative? We change the past with neg uh, into negative by adding didn't with the verb one. Okay, then. We add uh, the dents with verb one. Yes, here we have. I saw a good film last night. We want to make negative. How we make we we can make negative? I saw a good film last night. We add the dents and change the verb to the to verb one. I didn't see a good film last night. I didn't see a good film last night. They had a good time. They had a good time. We use the dance with verb one. They didn't have a good time. They didn't have a good time. Then had, change it to verb one, have. I gave you my tickets. I gave you my tickets. We use didn't with verb one, give. I didn't give you my ticket. I didn't give you my ticket. Number four, my parents bought me a computer. My parents gave me, uh, bought me a computer. Here we uh, use the dent with bought buy. My parents didn't buy me a computer. My parents didn't buy me a computer. Our aunts came to visit. Our aunts came to visit. We use the dance with uh, verb one come. Yes. Our aunts didn't come to visit. You sang a nice song. You sang a nice song. We use uh, negative with the dance with uh, verb one sing. You didn't sing a nice song. You didn't sing a nice song. See how lost hair pencil. See how lost hair pencil. We change it to negative with the dance with uh, and uh, return the verb lost to verb one lo lo lose. Siham didn't lose her pencil. Then, my dear students, uh, we use the past form, uh, the past uh, symbol, with uh, to talk about actions that happened uh, in the past. Uh, we use uh, the negative form with didn't with uh, the verb one. Uh, 
uh, that is all about lesson our lesson today thank you